Hello to all my Potter ones. I'm your Jedi Master today, and I want to welcome you guys to the full trailer breakdown for the new Star Wars The Last Jedi Awake trailer. Now, this trailer actually revealed some information about what's going on and all that kind of stuff. So, let's jump right into it. So, the first thing we see is Luke on the Ebon Hawk. Now, this is interesting. Why would he be returning to the Ebon Hawk? Well, it's kind of obvious that he could be returning to the Ebon Hawk because Rey's gotten him and she's on the Ebon Hawk and Chewie, because Chewie took her there and whatnot. That's pretty easy to deduce that it's because Rey is there. But he might be like, he might be realizing that, he might realize that Han is now dead. He might have, like, it, this might be the time whenever he realizes, oh my god, Han's dead, he was my friend, now he's dead, and what I'm, what's going on, and uh, blah, 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 that kind of stuff. So that'd be cr pretty, pretty interesting to, t to think about. Okay, so we also see a much more broad shot of Snoke in the trailer in the Red Room with uh, what look like to be Imperial Guards, the same kind that were protecting the Emperor. Um, and it is in fact that he is actually sitting in a throne and he does have the gold robe on, so not much there that's new, but just figured that I, I'd bring it up. Okay, so the next thing that we see that's uh, worth noting is that we see Finn go woo whenever the uh, whenever he they shoot down the Tie Fighter. Now this is really interesting because this both all these trailers have been showing Finn in various states. The original tra the teaser trailer showed him in, still in a coma. The Full trailer showed him it with the First Order, but then he fights Phasma. This trailer shows him fighting Phasma and fighting for the Rebellion. So, who really, like, like, who is Finn really fighting for? It's, it's one of those things that you have to ask. Who is he really fighting for? Is he fighting for the Rebellion? Or is he fighting for the First Order? Who is Finn fighting for? Okay, so now we get to the biggest point of this trailer. So, we see in the last trailer we saw, we heard and saw Luke going, this is not going to go the way that you think. And of course, we think that he's talking to Kylo back in the day whenever Kylo betrays him. And this trailer, they make it seem like that he's talking to Rey because the next thing that we see is Rey igniting her lightsaber and holding it up right here. Now, I do have a theory on this that I'll make in a different video. I'll leave a link whenever it's released down in the description box below. But I have a theory on this. But why they let's talk about here why he would be talking to Rey. Well, it could be the fact that maybe Rey is is struggling she's having more struggle i've talked about this in one of my star wars talks before that there is going to be so that there's probably going to be some moral struggle here that ray's going to have more struggle kylo's going to have more struggle it's going to be a it's going to be one of those times that i think that moral struggle is going to be introduced and it's very possible that ray's having this moral struggle and she's wanting to fight luke and He's been down this path before, and he says this isn't going to go the way that you think. So who really knows with that? So, what does this mean uh, in perspective? Well, one, it's going to show that that it's going to show a little bit more about Ray's dynamic. We're going we don't actually know a lot about Ray. Now, if you really think about it, we don't know a ton about Ray at all. Two, it's also going to show who does Finn really entrust to, because he's kind of a coward in the first movie, but for good reason. He saw the First Order's brutality and how they act and how malicious and evil they are, but he ends up coming back in the end as a good guy. But who knows what? Maybe he he could be programmed. We don't know. He's a stormtrooper. It's possible that he has programming and he's being forced to go back to the First Order, but he managed to break his programming, fight Phasma, and fight for the Rebellion again. Who really knows? So, with all that being said, 
I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Get ready for the theory video. I have a the I have the theory about who like it like why would uh why would Luke be talking to Ray and uh, all that? So anyway, I want to thank you everybody so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please give it a like. It does help out a lot. Tell a friend today about my Star Wars channel. It's pretty awesome. May the Force be with you. Always. <laughs>